And welcome to What's for Dinner, where we cook up these wonderful, healthy, nutritious meals every single day. I'm Ken Caustic. You certainly are, and I'm the very attractive and exciting Mary Jo Eustace Caustic. <laughs> and he's absolutely right. You are not. I Stop what? it. What? People are going to think we're married. Just a question. Whose funeral are you directing today? <laughs> what is going on there, what? man? It's you a fancy... It's a fancy dinner. You look so, like an undertaker. So I thought I'd dress up for you. Is that what you're doing? You like that? Oh, man. Sex on wheels. That's who you are, baby. Now, what are you doing today on What's for Dinner? Oh, I'm so psyched. Oh, I'm doing my mom's recipe. Your mommy's recipe? Her carrot Christmas cake from her book. Oh, is it Christmas? Oh, well. <laughs> you can. Yeah, you you know, can. You can do it anytime. You can serve it anytime you want. And, and it's probably good if it ruminates for a while. I'm doing a garlic soup. You're hence the smell of garlic You're doing here. a garlic soup? That yes, sounds delicious. Yes, special for you. You can plan babe. my funeral any day, baby. I'll call you Mr. Six Feet Under. Okay. Now, what I'm going to be doing, I'm doing a stuffed pork tenderloin with um, stuffed gorgonzola and some fresh herbs, so I think it'll be really nice. I think it'll be really delicious you're, today. You're looking fluffy. I am looking yeah. fluffy, yeah. like a sex kitten yeah. a little. But you know, you know, no, not really. No. No, I, I hate the flipping of the hair, but we'll talk about it when we come back. Just because you can't flip your hair, it'll come off your head. <laughs> See you later here on What's for Dinner. Welcome back to What's for Dinner. Uh, we're going to have a really wonderful, savory, delicious meal today. I'm very excited because Kenny's going to be doing a carrot cake, and I don't see him bake very much on this show, but uh, it's going to be delicious. Uh, it's going to be. It's going to be really wonderful, and I'm going to stuff my pork with gorgonzola and fresh sage, and I'm going to brown it in some butter using some flour. So it's going to be really, really good, I, I think. I'm grating. I'm you grating. are. You are Two grating. Cups. You are Two absolutely grating. of carrots. Okay. So... No, I think we this look very nice. nice today, uh, don't you? Why do we? Do you know why? Uh, we, we look nice? We're told to dress up. Oh, my gosh. Holy. Whoo. Whoa. Remind oh. you of anything? Smell oh. that. De oh. oh. That is oh, strong. But it's you strong. know what? It's I delicious, though. Gorgonzola, gorgonzola cheese is absolutely delicious. Yeah. Now, what I'm going to do is butterfly my pork, and I might pound my meat a bit because I enjoy doing that, and then I'm going to stuff it up. What? What's wrong with you? Why I'm not saying a thing. What? I'm not getting in trouble, okay? Oh my gosh. Whoa. Yeah, uh -oh. man. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Just touch yourself uh -oh. and calm yourself down. Oh, this is my, the, your my acupuncture, acupuncture point. Serenity Hygiene. Now. No. Serenity now. Hygiene. Hygiene. Serenity now. Hygiene, baby. Serenity. Now, do you know where the meat Ooh. pounder is? Do you know where my pounder Mama. Of meat is? Mama. Yes, darling. Please, don't pound your meat. I w I'm pounding my meat. Because you make a lot of noise when you do it. Oh, you can't do it quietly. And Hello? Daddy, daddy, daddy has a headache. What's today. wrong with Daddy today? So, don't, don't do that. That's don't. Fine. Do it. You know what? I just thought of something. What? This could be a very nice venue for your stripping. Do you think so? Like, yeah, like the, funeral, my new the act. funeral director, really serious, kind of creepy. Mm -hmm. And then you just peel it all off. Kind of the creepy look, and then you go, you jump over to the sexy creepy look. Yeah, but yeah, because once I take it all off, it's even more creepy. It's creepy, baby. Yeah. But this could really work for you because yeah. you look so nice today. I can't believe it, but you look really wonderful. Very attractive man, I think. I do. <laughs> you think I'd make any money? Uh, stripping? Yeah. Absolutely not. <laughs> I don't think you'd make any. It's not called stripping. It's called peeling. It's called peeling. No, it's called exotic dancing. Right. Oh, that's attractive. Oh, it's from my sweater. We'll just pull that off. So, yes. uh, this is a wonderful, wonderful carrot cake recipe. And I'm going to be standing here, I think, for an hour. Grating, grating. your carrots. Yeah. Now, the thing, I think, with... Um, I'm going to go to the... Um, to the high tech information center. Absolutely, but I'm going to the plastic wrap center and I'm going to put this on top of my meat and pound it. Oh. <laughs> 
problem. Uh, see, just somehow, ran out of money, low budget. Oh dear. Well, I can, somehow I don't think you're going to be pounding. I'm going to pound a corner of my meat. I'm going to actually, you know, this happens at home, and I'm going to reuse my plastic wrap and repound. You're I'm gonna, a professional. How long are you going to do that for? Yeah, I'm leaving. Oh. He's gone. Oh my gosh, it's like a dream come true. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pound my meat like this. And you want to make it nice and thin so it cooks quite quickly. And then we're going to stuff this with some good cheese so it's going to be delicious. Woo! That's quite a workout. Oh. There you go. We okay, pounded that's it. it. What? That's What's wrong it. with you? <laughs> what is happening here? What oh, is what's going for on? Dinner? Do you need this? What is going on? I'm done with this. I don't know. It happens. Crap happens, Kenny. You've got to get used to it in the world we live in. Okay, you I'm just going to wash you my hands. You know what? I'm going to tell you something, Miss Eustace. Uh, are you talking to me? Uh, quit. That drives me. I'll tell you two things drives me. The valley girl talk. Right. 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 And the swinging, flipping of the hair. Why? Miss Flippy hair. It guys just... love this. Guys so get into this. Well, this guy does not love that. Well, guys love it. That's why I'm not no. talking about you. Okay, I'm going to get my spooner, <clears throat> and I'm going to put my cheese in and my fresh herbs, and then I'm going to truss up my meat, and then I'm going to brown it, and we'll put this in the oven. Just have a quick read, because I want to be accurate for our viewers. 375 degrees for 25 minutes, and I'm going to do it in some nice wine, so that'll be delicious. Now, did I tell you that Perry... Right. You know, my neighbor Perry. Yes, Perry has got the hots for me, obviously. No, uh, no he didn't actually say that. You told me he did. Well, he's, I said he liked you as a person. You said he had the hots for me. Okay. Now you're changing your tuner. No. He yes. had, uh, he had a, well, he, he might like you better if you go to one of his parties. I want to go to his hot tub party. He has a hot, he has a new hot tub. I told you about that. Yes. And, go on. Um, he had a big party back there. Kept all the neighbors up. Yes. Caused a problem. Yes. Everybody complained except me right. and Jill next door. Because you're a party animal? We, no, we, you know, we just closed our doors. Like, let the guy live. You know, right. let people be who they are. Like, this like, whole yuppie culture oh, and, like, everything is plastic and perfect and sanitized and yeah. hygiene to the nth degree. Like, enjoy your life, you know? Exactly. Like, things are, just get in touch with what's natural. Like, odor is natural. You know what I'm saying? Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm just going to put some sage in I meant to in talk it. to you about that. <laughs> Everybody, everything it is It might be natural, but I work very <laughs> close beside you. No, everything is just so prepackaged today in our society. I wish we'd just get back to basics. That's yeah. what I'm thinking. So I'm totally supportive of Perry. Yeah. Now I'm going to trust. Good guy. Have you ever been trust before? Uh, not, not recently. Not lately. No. Now we're just going to roll this up and we've got our delicious sage and our blue cheese. And uh, we're actually working on this show. What are you doing? I, I'm, I'm grating. You're still grating your carrots. I got one more carrot and then that's it. I don't care if I have two cups or not. That's all I'm doing. There you go. <laughs> your mother was here right now. Oh. She'd tan your height. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh Press your ear. I want to talk to you about your mother. No, don't be going on. Well, I just she, think there's she, some issues there. She arrived back yesterday. She's not coming back All right. for a while. Yes. And uh, she gave the people at the airline, uh, you know, a real hard time. Why? She told me. She phoned me last night. She said... Can, don't ever book me on any of those electronic tickets anymore. Why? You know those electronic tickets? You right. don't need a, you know, you don't need a ticket anymore. Right. She hates it. She needs something in her hands. She needs a boarding, she needs a ticket in her hands. Is your mother kind of high maintenance? Well, well, you're both so high maintenance. It's just so bizarre to see the two of you together. It's yeah. just really odd because you both need a lot of attention. Do you I think find. we look alike? Absolutely. Oh, you don't should. you? Oh, you, did I tell you about the time I took her on a cruise for her birthday? No. Oh, oh. Why? Oh, it was Why? so funny. Why? Why was it funny? Well, you know, bingo. She she had to get her seat like four hours in advance right. on, for her bingo. Is she a bit anal retentive, your mother? Well, you know, let's put it this way: she wouldn't leave the uh, the slot machine. Right. So I had to give her bathroom breaks. So and I so had... you would sit in the slots? Right. Well, that's a good sign. That's a nice I thing. think that right. that's okay. But you know what? i got to tell you something. Oh, I dropped my string. On the cruise, she knew everything. Oh, oh. Oh, oh you know. What, what that happened? That threw me. Oh, did it throw you? Yeah. Can you cut my string because this went on the floor? Uh, Just cut it, all right? Just cut it. I'll, get, I'll cut it for oh, you. Oh, would you? There you go. Thank you. Okay, let's we'll put that on the floor there. She knew everything that went on in that ship. Really? She'd say, see that woman over there, Kenny? And I'd go, yeah. 
That's not her husband, you know. Is she know. a Nancy Parker, you mean? Oh, yeah. Total That's Nancy not her Parker? husband, you know. Gossip like her little son? She said, you could, you could feed me to the sharks oh, my, before I'd go out Number with one, him. you're getting so into it and your lip just trembled. You totally creeped me out just then. That Did was, I look like Oh, her? man. i got a trivia question for you. I'm not doing trivia today. Pardon me? You're doing it. <laughs> you are so doing it. In what movie did the term, I can't even read this cue card, figgy? Fig. Fish. Fig. Fish. Let me just look at my card. Oh, gosh, that is, somebody has got very bad penmanship. Oh. Uh, in what movie did the term food fight become famous? I thought it said food figgy. Well, she <laughs> spelled it wrong. Well, for yeah, it, it's fig eye. Fig eye. Well, we're professionals. I like my, uh, what's, uh, Someone uh, is trying to sabotage us. Are we us. on TV? Anyway, see you in a minute. On what's for dinner? Someone's We're going to be in a Can you believe that? Is that scary? Yes. Hello, and welcome back to What's for Dinner. I've grated my two cups of carrots. That only took me like 20 minutes. And now what I've got to oh, do. Oh, you are so what? completely. Doinkaroo. Look at all the stuff you've got in I, I here. Know. You, this is gonna, you've got like your garlic soup station and your carrot cake, and all you've done is grate at your carrots. Okay, I've what got, are you gonna do, Mr. I, Undertaker? I've got, <laughs> I've got my do? soup stock. Would you like to assess me while I'm living how much it would cost? <laughs> what, what type of coffin would I, I need? I wouldn't bother. Big one. Now, what, now, I need what I'd to like do... to do is we ask a trivia question to my good friend Kenny K. <laughs> Sir? Oh, man. Oh. Oh. Be careful. Well, oh, just... oh, 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 you got to press my button. Well, you, I do. No, thanks. In what movie did the term food fight become famous? Oh. Food figgy. Food, food figgy. <laughs> In what movie? Um, you probably saw this a million times. You and your friends probably watched this and had a beer. Animal House. Oh, my gosh, you knew it. How did you know oh, it? Oh, what do I get? What do you get? Not that leftover cheese, I hope. What would you like? No, I I'm don't. I'm looking very good today. No, you, you, I could rock your world. No, you couldn't rock oh, my world. Oh, that makes me feel a little nervous. Move that over there. That's no, pressing. I'm I can't. Here. This is soup station A. Okay, then move it over here. No, you, you've got My cord won't stretch. Okay, this is what we're going to do. Come here. Mama. Mama, you come to Papa. Come here. Come here. Number one, we're going to get rid of that because you know this by memory. Oh. Okay, now plug in your um, little machine, and what I'm going to do is brown my fork. Oh, there it is. Okay, yeah, there we go. Get down there. Okay, plug it in, Kenny. Is it a two-pronger? Are you all right? Oh, watch your head. Oh, sweetie, Ouch. that's too bad. We're going to melt our butter, uh, and then we're going to... Let me Watch my pantyhose. You shouldn't have this on the hot element. Out of here. Oh. <laughs> Hygiene. Hygiene right now. Okay. okay, thank you. Now, I'm going to brown my pork, and we're just melting our butter. Where are my wiener tongs? Here they are. Here are my tongers, and we're going to... I can't... Oh, you know what? what? What's wrong? What's oh, wrong? Wait till I tell Helen you threw her book. I'm so not scared of Helen. Uh. You? I, I'm not. When you when she was here, you were so nice to I her. I love your mother. I totally love your and mother. And then when she leaked, oh. She completely cut you up with her. This is never going to happen. Kenny, why don't you mix it by hand? No. Oh. What's wrong? What's wrong to I you? don't want to touch this because I don't want to go to the hygiene, hygiene center. Hygiene center. I can't wait till we rip it off because the ear hair is going to come off too, isn't it? <laughs> Please, God. Okay, we're oh. going to brown this. Kenny, Kenny. Yeah. No, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Leave me alone. Okay. We're Go gonna, away. Gonna... Get out of my nightmare. Stop it. Okay. What's wrong with you today? I need What's to wrong? add. Okay. All this is is uh, for the kick cake you... mixture. Is we need to add in. I'll take this oh, out. Okay, Doki. All right. Uh, I'll I'm leave, just going to put a little this. flour on my pork, and uh, then we're going to brown this. This is going to be so delicious. Okay. In goes we'll the get carrot. This going. I'll just put this on high type deal and get this happening. The I flour. have time to clean up now. The eggs. What's that stuck there? I've never seen that before. That's vanilla. No, this. What's this? Oh, that's fruit. Or dried fruit? I've yeah. never seen dried green fruit before, but it looks delicious. It's candied fruit. Oh, that's candied what it is. fruit. Yeah. All right. Gosh. Okay. Okay. Now, it, so we put our four eggs in. Look right. at that. It's all in. That looks delicious. It's all in the wrist. That's what you said. Now, I've started my soup. No, you haven't. Yes, you, I have. I've turned it on. Your water? Yes. Where are my wiener tongs? They're right in here. In goes the sugar. Okay. We're doing oh, some candied fruit. <clears throat> okay. And your raisins. You want your raisins? No, not all of them. And probably you want your dried herb mixture. Oh, I need there the you go. And do the nuts go in? Chances are they do. Oh, right. I need. Up. Just oh. mix it up. Some mix baking it up. soda. <laughs> serenity now, serenity baking now, powder. serenity now. And a little bit of salt. Yeah, serenity I'm now. I'm just going to S&P my pork tenderloins, and I'm starting to brown them, and I put a little flour in, and oh, they smell delicious with the gorgonzola and the sage. 
Okay, we'll get this. You know this makes it makes two loaves, don't you? It makes two loaves. I know. Okay. So there you I, go. I need to give you a tip. Okay. Avoid nuts that are discolored and sh or shriveled. Why? <laughs> Stand back, Mama. <laughs> no, that's not good. <laughs> in the back porch. <laughs> no! I'm out going. in the back. No, you are not going to. You are going to clean up this crap. You are not doing I'm, the soup today. I'm the going soup to... is over for no! you. You are cleaning up. I, it I want... is over. Done. There goes your water. Go. Go. <laughs> clean this crap up. Oh my. I need to be at my soup station. You need to be somewhere. Okay, now I've just got my wiener tongs and I'm going to um, turn my pork over and it's browning very nicely. We'll just do that. And then... I, we... I'm at my soup station. Oh my god, I look oh. so nice today. Oh. I can't believe you did this to me. Oh. I look so pretty. I didn't do it on purpose, honestly. I've got a tip of the day. You might want to try this when you're cooking your pork. You might want to take a thermometer and get a nice internal temperature. Where's the And the internal temperature should be, well, I'm going to guess, 137 degrees Fahrenheit is going to kill all bacteria. Okay, so we're just going to do this. This looks wonderful. And I'm going to put this in my dish. And I've got a little bit of carrot and uh, raisins, but that'll be nice with my pork. I'm going to put the butter over, a little white wine, and we'll get this off to the raisins. I think it's going to be quite nice, you know. I, you know what? I need to add in my 24 cloves of ground garlic. <laughs> That's going to be into wonderful. Into my soup stock. Here's my white wine. This is going in at 375 degrees for about 20. Oh my gosh, I've got raisins on my shoes. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> They do not pay me enough for this crap. You know what? I'm going to clean that up. When? In the break. I'm sure you are. Um, I love what's I'm for in? dinner. I moved to Winnipeg from the States in June, and I fell in love with the show from the start. Mary Jo and Ken not only make cooking fun, but to top it off, they're very knowledgeable in the culinary arts. What show are you watching? I try to make the time every day to catch the show. I'm I have just finished reading their bios, and I was very surprised to read that Mary Jo's an I'm accomplished singer-songwriter, which is something I hope to be. I would also like to know when Mary Jo's due date is for a baby. Well, I gave birth um, seven months ago, roughly. Um, and also, I hope that I look half as good as she does when I'm pregnant. Thank you so much. I hope this is a girl. It is. Janine Parsons, thank you very much. Very, very, very nice letter. Oh, gosh. All right. I got a walnut stuck to my foot. Okay, I've added in my soup stock. I brought it to a boil, oh, reduced it to I a simmer. I am so angry with you. Garlic. Look I'm at a... the bottom of my shoe. I'm sorry. Look at this. <laughs> These are new shoes. <laughs> Ken Caustic. These are new shoes. Mama. Uh, I'm adding in, oh no, I'm adding in my fried herb mixture, which we've got my basil, oh. bl uh, white pepper, and salt, and the key, this is the key to this. You know what the key Before we wind you know it up. You know what the key to working with this is vodka. See you in a minute here on what's for dinner. I can Dijon mustard, Dijon mustard. Hello, and welcome back to What's for Dinner. I, I have to apologize. I had a little mishap, but I saved it, and I did do some cleaning up. You can tell. I cleaned well, up everything. Well, actually, it's three hours later, and we had a cleaning crew come in to clean up his crap, and he's upset because he got something on his little undertaker suit, and he's going to sue the production. So that's the <laughs> truth of it all. Now he's putting his carrot cake in raw. Into the oven. Right? And, and he's going to pull out a baked loaf because it's the magic of TV. No, I, no, 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 Mama. I'm going to let that bake, and I'm walking Kenny, up to Kenny, you are not going to sell this for one minute that your carrot cake's done, okay? I, I have just pureed my garlic, garlic soup. soup, and oh, doesn't it smell wonderful? Ugh. And I'm going to grate some fresh Parmesan in. Oh, I'll take this out for uh, yeah, take out the safety in the appliance. kitchen. Okay, now let's go to the stove and find out something really interesting. Number one, here's Kenny's carrot loaf that ah! somebody had to make for him because he didn't have the wherewithal to do it himself. And what we also have is my stuffed pork tenderloin with fresh sage and gorgonzola cool. cheese. Doesn't that sound yummy in your tummy? Yeah. Doesn't that sound good? I'm going to put it on a platter and cut up some fresh herbs with it. So I think it's going to be really delicious. Wow, your, your loaf's a little heavy in the middle. You have a little sinkage here. Well, it just, it caved in, baby. You know, these things happen, but it's all in the flavor. It's all in the taste. All right. You say so. There you go. Okay. Look at this wonderful garlic and potato soup 
with Can herbs. you keep it over there, though? No, no, baby. Seriously? It's coming, it's coming this oh, way. Oh, man. And this goes to the hygiene center. And you should go to the hygiene center. <laughs> now, what I've got is uh, obviously some of the cheese has melted and um, leaked out, so we put that on top as a delicious Ooh. sauce. Ooh. And we have a little white wine. And what I'm going to do is cut up some fresh herbs, and this is absolutely delicious Ooh. and savory and wonderful. You know what? I love pork tenderloin. Do you? There Very you said it. Oh, yeah. there you said it. Whoa, whoa, that was a good one. Are you ever going to forgive me for that? I don't know. I think some cash is involved. I think some cash. I wanted to look really attractive today for our viewers. You and, did. And, you know, I got raisins on my shoe, and I got flour and stuff on my Angora sweater. I picked the raisins off, though. With your teeth. <laughs> now, what I've got here is some fresh thyme, and I'm going to chop that up oh. and put that on top of my oh, pork. So that'll be good. Look at my mum's wonderful carrot cake. With little candied fruit. Doesn't Do you want to cut a piece? Yeah. Why sure. don't you cut a piece, little awesome. guy? Little poupe mouth, my little booby booby, my little undertaker. Now, I'd like to recap. Okay. Water and garlic. Yeah. Uh, we have garlic and potatoes. Oh, you know, Gar don't give me attitude, okay? <laughs> Do not give me attitude today. Ah, garlic, mama. potato, puree. You know, if you did that right now, you know what I do? What? It would ah! that. Oh, yeah. Kenny goes to Kendra in two ah. seconds flat. Uh, stuff of pork, and I don't know what this is, but it's sagged in the middle somewhat like Ken. So listen, keep watching. We'll see you next time here on What's for Dinner. Hopefully he'll be in therapy again, because he's not in it right see now. See ya. Bye. No, no.